What's good with you guys? Welcome back to another brand new episode of Tales of Mysterium Host Freak. So today, the tragedy. Oh well, I mean, hey, what, what, what y'all gonna do about it, right? Am I right? No. Okay. <laughs> All right, but God, 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 oh, look. <clears throat> okay, bet. I never expected that Velvet would actually eat Teresa. What else could she do? We never expected that Teresa would be a Therian either. Velvet and Lady Teresa weren't so different. They both loved their brothers. No, they loves their brothers. They're just <laughs> dead. No, no, no. So where does this lead? There's difference into it. Seems we must search for the new Therian that will fill the void left by Teresa. It won't be easy to find another who could become a Therian. <laughs> Then it won't be easy for the Abbey either. And they still may not be able to awaken in Nominat. We still can't assume that we're in the clear, though. Mm. No, we can't. If it takes time for the Therian to be reborn, this could be our chance to strike. Whatever happened, the seven uh. Therian's ties have been severed from Inominat. But we mm. won't know if the Empyrean has been weakened until we find out for ourselves. I can try and see if I can sense the new Therian. So let's go back to the prison island first. But I think... Velvet needs time to rest. Right. If we're gonna take down Artorius, she has to be there with us. Yeah. Oh, God. God, oh, God. That was an intense fight, y'all. Y'all, you have no idea. How intense that fight was! Like the fight wasn't too bad either, but like just the uh, just the story right now. Like this is the intense part right here. We almost there. We almost. We almost home. Oh God! Like this sad music that they play. They play this sad music. We killed. We killed two extras. Well, I mean, we kind of start get to attach like. But at the same time, like, so, in the game, they try to make them at least decent characters. At least Teresa. They try to make Teresa a good character so we can at least feel bad for when she dies. I feel a little bad, like, eh, you know, okay. Yeah, it's kind of messed up that they died and this backstory and all this other crap. Alright, there we go. So let's keep going. Look at this music. The 
tragic music of two people. Oh, wow, okay. First mate, there's trouble. We got an emergency message from Port Zexen. A ship carrying dozens of exorcists just set sail for Titania. They have orders to eliminate the Lord of Calamity. Yeesh. Looks like the hideout's not so hidden after all. Because... It wasn't me! I didn't tell them anything! Then you won't have any problem helping us. We're rescuing the Therians. Of course not! I won't let them take Kamoana again. Wait. That information came from the Bloodwings? No. From a peddler I often do business with. Exorcist operations like this are usually kept a closely guarded secret. And you're telling me a regular civilian knew about it? You think it's a trap? Trap or not, we don't have a choice. Our enemies know the odds. If they've set a trap for us, that means they think they can win. The Armatus! Yes, they're likely to throw armatized exorcists at us. Even your demon arm can't eat Armati. You might just have a real problem on your hands. If I can't devour them, then we kill them. Yeah, <laughs> if we overcome the Armati, we can win. Like with Oscar. But his Armatus was still incomplete. From what I could gather, if the Exorcist remains Armatized for too long, their Moloch will turn into a dragon. But to prevent these dragons from running wild, Melchior embedded a self-destruction art in both Exorcist and Moloch. To think they would go that far. Oh. This is all just conjecture, of course, but we should prepare ourselves as best we can. Just make sure not to leave any regrets behind. <sighs> Yo, I'm telling you, it's... I really can't fathom what the Abbey is doing. Even I'm telling you, it's... No purpose, why would they leave us it's my man. I would have expected them to press the attack against us. Even if their aim is to capture our allies as some kind of leverage against us, their plan is too many holes. What if we decided to abandon Kamuana and the others? They'd be no closer to capturing Velvet. Do they actually want the Therians back? What are you saying? Why did Melchior place that illusion on a ball to lure Velvet in? That was so he could capture her, right? And in case he couldn't capture her, he could kill her and create another Therian. Okay. So if securing the Therians is so important to them, why would they throw Orthrus to the winds? That's a puzzler. Melchior was right there. He didn't try to protect Orthrus at all. I don't understand it. It's like they're toying with us. I don't see any point in that either. They must know we won't give up. Actually, that could be close to the mark. What if they're just trying to rattle us? Everything would fit, including the assault on Titania. Whatever's going on. I don't think we're going to like it. All right, let's keep going. So, Eleanor, about that Armatus Oscar used, was that something the Abbey has been working on for a while? I was never involved in weapons development or anything like that, but I did hear of a secret research division. Word was that they were deciphering ancient scrolls and books coming from every yeah. corner of the Empire. Apparently, Teresa knew something of the ancient tongue, and they called her in to help from time to time. Did she work on Enominot's book? I was never privy to any of the details, but I think the books were mostly about controlling Malachim. Well, that Siegfried thing of Zavid's is some kind of power control device, right? The Abbey probably learned about Siegfried in one of those books, and realized they could use it to armatize. So Melchior tracked Zavid to stole the formula. Makes sense. Whew. It was all so they could create the Armatus. All right. Will Eifried be all right? Complete or not. They've seen that they can use the Armatus in battle. They have no use for him anymore. <sighs> Let's get back to Titania, Aizen. I'll help out with the ship. Right. Let's set sail. God. Man, th this is... It's starting to get it tits. This is when RPG started to get tits in the story.
We was doing so good too. It's an urgent message. Let him know that they'll be arriving at Titania within a few hours. I do it. I do it. All along, Bienfu. I'm surprised I didn't sense it. There is a Gesh on you, interfering with our pact. <laughs> well played, Melchior. Impressive. That old man must have planned all of this from the very moment you escaped me. Even my imprisonment in Titania and my encounter with Velvet. All calculated down to the minute. <laughs> Nice. F forgive me, Miss Mogilu. There was no way I could fight against Lord Melchior's arts. Uh, I don't care. I don't care about anything. And I don't care that I don't. Damn. I knew it. I, I knew it. I knew it. But they do. They know. They know. We were listening. We heard it all. Oh, boring. Fine then. Do with us what you will. It's not like I trusted you to begin with. Spy or no spy, this was inevitable. Besides, you're not sorry. Make yourself useful and fight for us. <sighs> you're good at this cruelty that's also compassion thing, aren't you? I just don't have the time to deal with you two. After this whole business is over with, I'll devour you, if that's what you want. Hey, Velvet. Tell me, what does it feel like to... hate? Does it torment you? Is it agony? Does the searing fire of your hatred empower you to feel? Does it give your life meaning where there was none? Mark, it was the true villain the whole time. There's an Abbey ship in the front docks. Take us around back. If you want your answer, fight by my side. You'll see it the very moment I kill Artorias. Damn. In the face of doom, still the crow caws defiantly. <laughs> You really know how to vex me. Damn. <laughs> I knew I I knew it. I knew he I knew the little mother The way he talked about everybody in the instances, I knew it. I was like he feeding your information. So you're using the forbidden arts. This has to be Melchior's doing. <laughs> The Lord of Calamity. That again? What a melodramatic name. It's what you're called by the scores of citizens whose lives you've ruined. Face the enormity of your sins. No. What idiocy. Huh. We'll carve the weight of your sin from your flesh. We are the wings of the divine will. So the enemies get stronger. As expected. Yeah. 
It had the Magulus character was just meant for the story to be less dark. But she plays a little bit more of a character. Oh, 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 oh. Oh, they were dying anyway. Yes. Yes. They were dying anyway. They destroyed themselves. Just as I expected. The Abbey. They know exactly what they're doing. Of course they do. You don't know. You don't know. Grimoire. Where are the Therians? Couldn't tell you. They came out of nowhere, and before I knew it, we were all split up. How's the book? Nearly done, but I'm still working on the critical passages at the very end. All of you, get on board the Von Eltia. I'll find the Therians. Oh? You really think we can make it past a horde of armatized exorcists? Stay behind. I don't care. Ugh. Don't touch that! You don't have to do this alone. We're all in this together. And I promise. I promise I'll protect you, Velvet. Oh, he tried to win over Velvet Heart. Long ago, Mafi said the same thing. But that sort of idealistic drivel will kill you. Damn. Make your worthless promises. They won't change reality. Look what happened to Wafi. Dead. Murdered. And I... I couldn't protect him either. There's a man, no matter how much he cared for me, my only brother, he... His life torn away from him. Oh, it must have hurt. Velvet. You worry about yourself, Luffy said. That's an order. An... an order. Damn, why you make him do this, Velvet? You know me not out of the picture. So that I can kill Artorius. Let's go! We'll push the enemy- Me back and keep an eye out for the Therians. She'll be all right. I know this isn't the best time, but I have something to say. Please forgive me. I've been a spy for Lord Melchior. You were the one telling the Abbey about us? Yes. I'm so I knew sorry. he was. I knew he was. <laughs> Melchior is a clever one, isn't he? Planting a spy right next to Magilu. After all, a forest is the best place to hide a tree. Melchior used his arts to place orders on Bienfu that overrode Magilu's pact. <sighs> that son of a dog. <laughs> Please don't hate me! <laughs> I meant Melchior, not you. Really? Exerting control over someone else's life goes against everything Aizen stands for. We know you were forced to do it against your will. But my spying put everyone in serious danger. That's still a fact. The Bloodwings also knew what we were up to. The Abbey would have figured it out with or without you. What'd you tell them anyway? Um, uh, that Velvet is actually pretty good wife material? And what fishing rods Aizen prefers? And what Miss Mogulu says in her sleep? And how fast Dial's tail regrows. What? That's what you told them? It's done. Pay it no more heed. 
but things must be set aright. All right? How? Eleanor, I apologize for suspecting you. I'm sorry. Aizen? That's right! I must apologize as well! I'm deeply sorry, Lady Eleanor! Very well. Apologies accepted all around. Are exorcists using armatization aware that it could cost them their lives? I'm sure they are. <laughs> if I were still with the Abbey, I would likely be using an armatus too. Endangering one's own life in order to save the many? It's the logical choice. But using something that dangerous so frequently in battle is absolutely wrong. The Abbey mm. must be starting to feel the pressure mm. too. Even so, the losses are unacceptably high. That's how badly they want the Therians, and how big a threat we represent. Or it could be that it has nothing to do with us, and the real point is to test their new weapon. That can't be. It's all an experiment? A blade proves its true worth by making <laughs> it through battle unbroken. Are exorcists all that different? Your logic is sound, but it's still awful. We were able to survive this time, but it won't be much longer until they've perfected the armatization. That's not the only thing we need to worry about where ticking clocks are concerned. Am I wrong? Velvet. It doesn't matter. We kill whoever gets in our way. Man, that boy... <laughs> that boy loves him some velvet. He like, I need some of that velvet booty. That's right, baby. I'll follow you to the ends of the earth. <laughs> Damn, we get... Oh, shit. Yeah, what the hell? Let's try to avoid some of these traits. Are we ready for this? Oh shit. Get up, cat, get up. Somebody heal me. Too. Makes me sick. But still, it fits their reason. They want strength, and no art can squeeze strength from a Moloch like that one. Oh shit. Ah, damn it. Oh, thank God, you here. I need some drugs and make it snappy. All right, get some life stuff. I bought weapons throughout this whole entire game.
All right, whatever. Let's keep let's keep moving. And here I thought we was at a secure spot, so I thought this was gonna be like they had nice music and everything playing. So you all got away. It was all I could do to flee. I have lost face. You don't have a face! Uh, I was so scared! It's okay now, dear. <laughs> I won't let them cause you any more pain. Alright, but... Odessa was the one who saved us. Thank you. I could never forgive them for involving children. That's all. Kuragane, head to the rear docks. Keep them safe. If you find the prince and Griffin, take the Von Eltia and escape. As you wish, Roguro. Take the Storm Quell. I made it with the Orichalcum you gave me. You actually did it? I abandoned all desire and forged it with a clear mind. You will find no harder sword in all the world. Stormquell, made from Orichalcum. Alright, but... Well, Kurogane. So now I'm here, Kurokokin. It's complete! The Orichalcum blade, Stormquell! It's the hardest blade Rook the world has ever known. Even to an untrained eye, that sword is obviously something special. Kurogane is a real master! <laughs> Color me amazed! The God Blade Storm Howl. Damn, look at Storm Quell. This will be something to see. Will it end in triumph, or will you need to try more oomph? The gods alone know. The gods have nothing to do with it. Skill alone will determine who lives and who dies. <sighs> All right, so managed to avoid capture, huh, Prince? As did you. You did well to avoid Artorius and his forces. Lord Artorius is here? He is. I overheard some exorcists mention it. Artorius. If you want to die, do it alone. We're saving the Therians before anything else. Besides, we're so close to deciphering the ancient book. I know. We'll escape from the rear docks. Follow me. Watch out, Princey Wincy. You ain't no Therian. If Griffin gets there first, we're leaving you behind. Uh, understood. Okay. Now we gotta go back up for oops. And here I thought we were so safe to exclude it. We had nice music playing. So wait, hold on, go back, go, go back down, go back down, go back down, go back down. Nothing. Okay, my bad. I guess we can't do it here. Man. <laughs> Man. leader would risk using an art that could end his own life but the shepherd's reputation would be ruined if he self-destructed over some botched formula on the other hand if the risk is mm. based on the user's ability then the legates might not have any trouble so if Artorius were to try he'd armatize with Inomina <laughs> can an Empyrean be used as an armatus I'm not sure right. Artorius can handle that he'll do it why else would he try to revive Inomina but we're talking about an Empyrean He'll succeed. I'm certain of it. This is the Shepherd Artorius we're talking about here. Whether God or Devil stands in his way, he won't be swayed. That's who he is. 
velvet. But it won't save him. He'll die by my hand. Empyrean or no Empyrean. That's what I heard when we shot, Oh, he's gonna keep. Oh, God! <laughs> and Velvet's right arm's not working, so that's the issue I have to deal with while I'm using Velvet. But everybody else, they seem like they know what they're doing. They really want me to take this long way. They, they don't want me to take the short way. They, they don't want me to take the short way. They're like, you talking about taking this easy way? Huh? Ison, there's trouble. The enemy found the Von Eltia. Several enemy ships are heading this way right now. Set sail, now! Yeah, Reaper's Curse. Velvet, come on! Velvet, come on! Velvet, come on! Life is sick. Talk to you. Talk to this girl. I'm, uh, glad we were able to save everyone. <laughs> you can't use that right arm, baby girl. You can't use that right arm. Go! 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 Oh my god! I like the way they jumped, though. I Velvet, damn it, Velvet! Benwick, forget me. Take the Von Altia and leave now. That's madness. What do you think you're doing? If I don't take them down, they'll sink you from afar. Raise anchor. We'll make it through somehow. Yay! We get the crew <laughs> the same. But don't die. You hear me? Ooh. Crazy kids. We're not going to die. We're going to kill. Damn. Are you fucking kidding me? I can't fight with Velvet. Honestly, I can't. Like, Velvet literally can't fight like that. Steal an Abbey ship, I take it. That's where the Abbey's main forces will be concentrated. And Lord Artoria should be there too. All the better. But we still don't have a way to fight Enominot. You really don't. I told you, if you want to die, do it alone. I'm not asking you to come with me. Damn, girl. Damn. Just damn. Use me. Percival. Don't worry. Griffin got away. If you use me as a hostage, you should be able to steal a ship. I owe you one for this. But don't expect gratitude. I don't. Damn. Looks like this is our best and only bet. <laughs> the, the, the... Yay, we we'll leveled up. Can we can we fast travel? Is that something we got? Oh, 
Wow, that this is not the, the Oh damn. We're going to the front docks to escape. Don't forget that. I know. Arthur's first maxim, right? Damn, okay, we, we literally going all the way to the back, okay. How we get there, okay. I'm worried. About this whole hostage thing, you mean? Yeah, that too, but... Velvet's acting really strange. Really? And that's unusual how? Moggy Lou! Yelling at me won't change anything. Her thirst for blood knows no bounds. And she's got all the self-control of a wounded beast. With the way she's acting, I'm not sure she'll be able to escape. She's cut her way through all her problems before. She can do it again. I hope so. But everything has its limits. There's no blade that will not break. Nor is there such a heart. When the time comes, hey. you'll need to make a decision. It's best you start figuring it out now. What's when the, the time comes. What's the decision? Yeah, that's really uh... Well, looks like we shook off our pursuit. Of course Ooh. we did. This is the Von Eltia. No, it can't be. This is terrible. Turn back now. What? There's no way we can do that. I finally deciphered the last part of the book. If what it says is true, then you know me not is already. There. The coast is clear. All right, let's make a break for the docks. <laughs> You're running. Hand. No, do not face him. 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 Now's the time to negotiate for safe passage. Step back, your highness. The girl before you wants nothing other than to kill me. You better believe it! No! 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 Let me go! I have to save her! He wants to say He wants to save out of here too. I'm not your tool! Oh! Save my booty! I fucked with that shit. That nigga said, "I'm finna save the booty." That's what I'm finna do. Your Armatus isn't gonna stop me. Do you cry? I have another trick up my sleeve. He said, "I'm finna." That sword is that or a calcum? Good job, little bro. Never seen that before. Damn right. The hardest sword there is. It may be made of orichalcum, but still. Eat up for the eat up for the beat him. Eat up for the beat him. Stand down, shit. Don't be a spoil sport. I'm just starting to have fun. Get caught in the middle of this, and even you won't survive unscathed. The one to face Velvet will be a nominat. Uh, he like I'm gonna save my booty. That's what he said. He said I'm going to save the booty. That's what I'm gonna do. <laughs> Hello, sister. 
Did you miss me? Oh! Oh my God! Brother, so that's his game. Damn! I am Lafayette Crow, and more. Damn! Also, Imperian Inominat, the suppressor. Oh damn! 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 Just damn! gonna do this you gotta commit he's our enemy damn I know this is just just another illusion no that's the real deal I'll devour all of you at least I think it is at least I think it is at least I think it is shit oh my god I can't that's what you've been doing this whole time we can't fight him oh uh, He can't. Oh, fuck that. Fuck that. Mm-mm. Mm-mm. Fuck that. Mm-mm. Somebody. Bitch, you better heal me. Zero. Zero. Yo. He, we can't face him. We can't face him. At least with Artorias, he was able to get one or two. Hold up. This boy is Imperian in Nominat the Suppressor. But how? We took away his strength! By kidnapping the Therians? Sorry to burst your bubble, but you were a wee bit late. It was never about the amount of malevolence the Therians devoured. What we needed to awaken him was eight different types. Greed. Conceit. Lust, cowardice, selfishness, obsession. Those six Inomena had already obtained by the time you managed to tear the Therians away. Damn. It leaves just the two that Velvet carries inside her. Once Inomena has them, he will fully awaken. And I don't even need an Earth Pulse for that. R I need them right here. I tell you, Will! He, look at this! Look at this! He didn't even break in a sweat! He like, bitch, you get this shit out of my face! If you're that weak, stay out of my way. He said, bitch, get the shit weak shit out of my face! Damn, Velvet, no. Velvet, no. Velvet, no. Velvet, no. Stand back, baby girl. Stand back. Stand back. An illusion. That hurts, Velvet. Shut up! Shut up! Damn. Damn. Are you going to kill me, sister? Damn. That that is just <laughs> God damn. <clears throat> oh. Life say you ain't gonna you ain't gonna uh, step in and try to protect her. No, Velvet, no, Velvet, no, Velvet, no. I wanted you to live. I wanted you to be by my side. Velvet, no, Velvet, no, Velvet, no, Velvet, no. All I could do was offend you. To get my vengeance, I. I devoured. I killed. Damn, Velvet, 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 no. Of course you did. Velvet, no. I'm sorry. I'm sorry, Luffy. It hurt, didn't it? Fee! Kill him, please! But, please? It's Luffy, said! He's, he's my brother! 
Damn. Damn. God damn. God. <laughs> oh shit. Oh my god. I never wanted you to avenge me. I mean, it's that sort of selfish emotion that creates malevolence, that creates the demons. What? That's why I'm going to help Arthur. We're going to make all the pain in the world go away. Oh, God damn. Including that hate, that ugly malevolence in you. Ugly malevolence? Damn. Damn. Awakened in Nomenon will suppress all. Oh God, damn. He will remake humanity into beings free from sin. Look at this fool. Take away all their sins, and people aren't people anymore. I think that's just what they intend. Like how they steal free will from the Malakim. It will be a peaceful world, free from pain. Damn. This is. Your goal this whole time. Was to rob people of their free will? If even an exorcist like you can let your emotions tempt you to betrayal, clearly it is the only way. Here we go. No. Make this world a safe Damn. From demons. That has always been my dream. They is misspelling demons Damn. like crazy. My wounds will heal once I have eaten you, sister. What's going on? This is bad. We'll be swallowed alive. Wait. I always everything I did, I did for you. How could you do this to Thank you. It's because of what you've done that I need to make amends. You've hurt so many people. And all for nothing. Damn. can't just be hard you know it's got to be flexible too or it'll snap <laughs> if you're addressing me do you care to test that out nah I think I'll wait on that at least until you and a nominat finish up your armatization oh my god Shepherd Artorius what have you done it's all according to my plan, Your Highness. Let us return to the capital. Like hell. Why is we in this? <laughs> we back at this place again. <sighs> what just happened? We were eaten by an earth pulse. This happened to you before, didn't it? It's different this time. It looks like our awakened friend Inominat is using the land as his vessel. In other words, this Earth Pulse is now part of his body. I was able to flee him only because I found a rift in the Earth Pulse as it formed. So, Velvet and the others? I guess I won my bet. Took long enough. Bravo! You do have a talent, if nothing else. Oh, Melchior. If you're here, this place must be more important than I suspected. Move aside. I must close this Earth Pulse Rift. Bienzu, protect the Rift! Do well, and I'll forgive that little betrayal of yours! But if you run, my curse will follow you for eternity. Ush. Yeah, you got it. It looks like I just won my bet. 
If I let you seal this rift now, I'll never collect. Illusions won't work on me. You can't break a heart that's already broken. That day, I interrupted my art when your heart broke. I suppose I was taking pity upon my student. But this okay, so... That I won't hold back. I will grind your heart into dust! <laughs> Damn. I was gonna say, please don't let me oh. buggy loot again. Oh my god. You're awake. I'm glad to see you're okay. It looks like we got sucked into the earth pulse. Again. Are you alright, Eleanor? What about everyone else? I'm fine. But Kill. Kill. They killed so many. Murdered. Slaughtered. It was all for him. I killed for him. But he said I was ugly. Nothing. <laughs> nothing. All for nothing. Damn, she is broken. She is broken! <laughs> She is broken! She... The whole time, she... You're awake. Come on, we're leaving. I have to kill them. Buddy, know me not as your... It's just an illusion! A fake! A trick! Or... What if it was really him? Then that means he betrayed me, doesn't it? You think I can't kill a traitor like him? Why? Why wouldn't I? Damn, ba baby baby girl. Just how many do you think I've killed? You who watch me do it. Oh, that's right. He I'm Sorry. He did. Damn, he Velvet! Fluffy, time to wake up. Told you to stop calling me Luffy. I'm not a little kid anymore. <laughs> grumble, grumble, huh? You must be feeling good. Hmm. You know me not. I have a fever, I'm afraid. No, this is different. Uh, today. A vision of the past. Then, you stay in bed. <laughs> oh shit. <laughs> 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 I killed him. It was easy. I'm used to it by now. All right, we're getting out of here with your power. But now we gotta find Eisen and the rest. I said now. <laughs> Enough. Stop it. Yeah. They're the ones who need to be stopped. Yeah, she needs some of that slap. Slap. <laughs> Slapper gear. You must calm down. Fine. I'll calm down and look for an exit. That's what you want, right? <laughs> damn. God damn. Oh. Put in your pouch, Slappy set. Put it in that pouch. <laughs> Oh, I know you want to hit some of that velvet booty, but <laughs> you don't you, you don't want to hit crazy. You don't want to hit crazy. Case, we have to get out of here. Let's keep moving for now. Yeah, I guess so. Are you all right, Lappy said? Yeah, I am. <laughs> but I'm worried about Bill. This may be more than he can bear. Not that I blame him. Lappy said. Perhaps you should rest within me for a while. No. But if you don't, then... I know. But if I hide, it'll only hurt Velvet even more. I should at least be at her side. You really have become stronger. But I haven't. 
I hate it, but there's nothing I can do to help Velvet now. Of course there is. Having I mean, I can be all the help you need sometimes. <laughs> sometimes, you know, crazy. I lost my mother, Eleanor. So let's keep an eye on Velvet while we search for the others. All right. Just remember that I'm always with you, Luffy said. I know. Thank you. Yeah, sometimes you know that crazy booty ain't it. But we go in the video here. So you got to do the video. Drop a like, subscribe, guys, and then comment down below. Till next time. Ooh, bye.